My name is Jay Davies. I'm uh, going to be taking you for a microscopy practical next week, and we're going to be teaching that lesson. What I want to do today is show you around the microscopes that we're going to be using. So if you want to come in, I'll show you the different parts of that one. To start off with, we'll start from the top. We've got the eyepieces. It's a binocular microscope, so there are two eyepieces. You can adjust them, moving them forwards and backwards, putting them closer together. Coming down from the eyepieces, we've got the objective lenses. These are these can change what the magnification is that you view the actual microscope slides on. The eyepieces are times 10 magnification, then you times that by whatever objective lens you're using. For example, times 10 objective, times 10 eyepiece, the image is magnified 100 times. Below the objective lenses, we have the stage. This is where you set your microscope slide, and this is where you can adjust it. These are the stage adjustment screws. The top one moves it forward and backwards. The bottom one moves it side to side. Coming back around, this is the adjustment knobs for the microscope. This actually adjusts the image and gets it into focus. This is the coarse adjustment knob, and as you can see it actually moves the stage up and down. When you get an image roughly in focus, you use the fine adjustment knobs to get it a real crisp image. This is the base of the microscope. Here's where the light path comes through, and then you switch that on and off here. You adjust the um, intensity of the light using this screw here. Just some key points about safety. You should always hold the microscope at the back here and underneath the base because they're very delicate and then always be careful about glass slides as they can easily break if you move the course adjustment too close to the objective lens. The microscope. I shall be seeing you on Monday.